afternoon all. It's not as hot as it was yesterday. It's about two o'clock. Mum and stepdad have gone out. My brother's upstairs. My sister's at work. So I've got some time to myself. Right. Here we go. Might as well start up here and work back. The brick shed. Which will be... My brother's studio. When all this is gone. So, a bit of work to do in here, a bit of paint. Already got his light up. Right. There was a shed here. That's the first one we took down. Which enabled us to pile all the wood to build the workshop there. Pile of bricks. Sack barrow. Sack barrow. Sack barrow. Do you think we've got enough sack barrows down here? There was a shed here. We took that down yesterday. So, two down, one to go. But, uh... <laughs> we've got to find a home, a temporary home for all this. This will be used when the workshop and the model railway room gets built, so that's not a problem. Neither is most of this wood in here. That's going to be used in the building as well. So, really we only need to worry about keeping that dry, but I think we've got some covers. If not, we'll have to get some. But there's some big sheets of MDF and plyboard buried under that. Which we will need. And we're going to recycle this stuff as well. Because it's all screwed together. So, it'll be easy enough to take it down. Hopefully I won't bang my ha head on it. Because, uh, there's a wooden shed there with like a, I don't even think I'd call it a lean-to, it was just a gap between the two sheds covered up. I banged my head on the corner of one of these, so I've got a lovely big scratch on my head. And a bump, actually, it's come up as a bump. Fence panels. That's a job to do. Replace all this and build new gates. Because, uh, yeah, the gates are a bit past it and they're a pain in the ass to open and close. A bit of scrap down here to go. I know a man that will collect that. Uh, yeah. Anyway, the back garden. Went and got one of these because we want the grass to grow back. Don't mind where I'm walking. Oh, we better pick these tools up as well. We've just uh, did this today as well. It was just easy and it looked a bit tidy. I'll tidy this up with some cable clips. In fact, there is some indoors, so I might do that while they're out. There's a bike that was left here. It's a strong blow. Look at this. Strong bow cider. So I'm tempted to restore that, just because it's unusual. And the times have held there, so... Yeah, so I'm going to find some clips, and I'm going to clip that up. There's a solar light me and a friend rebuilt last night, because the main bit had just got too much water in it and too much corrosion. So I modified it. I've just changed the tyres on this beast. Might as well walk you through the house. Utility room. Am I zoomed in? No, oh, it's just how the camera is. This room has been decorated. I put that light up. I put that one up. Exactly the same as in the bedroom. My bedroom, that is, at home. Kitchen. Ooh, that's weird. 
ba ba ba. Zen Lounge. These are the only three rooms that have been decorated. Still a work in progress. It's gone quiet, but my brother's gone out. Stay in there, Peg. The front garden. My other bike. <laughs> Your bum. I'm just going to say hello to Bob, shall we? Well, we got a chair missing. We got a chair missing, Bob. Then. Bob, where are you? Here he is. <laughs> he is up for sale, though, because we haven't really got the room all the time to care for him. Right. The stairs. I won't go upstairs to help disturb Brad. Right. I've got things to do. Ah, clips. Clips and a hammer. Yeah. Very cheap clips, but I should do. Oh yeah. Outside light. Outside light. Ready for this? Actually, there was a floodlight just there. I took that one down. And another one up there, which isn't connected at the minute. And there was also one, which I'm going to put back up once I've cleaned it all up, up here. Because it's going to get dark down here at night, so... And in winter, if my brother's going to be in and out of his uh, studio, he's going to need a light. Anywho. Thanks a lot for watching. I'll talk to you all again soon. I've got jobs to do.